a show of strength as tensions mount. Venezuelan military chiefs say they've begun mobilizing some 150,000 troops along the country's 2,200-kilometer border with Colombia, starting here in the western border town of La Fria. Armored vehicles, mobile missile launchers, and snipers on hand for military exercises with no end in sight. This activity will be maintained indefinitely. We'll be deployed here, doing searches, patrolling, investigating and, when appropriate, carrying out necessary interceptions. The government of Nicolas Maduro has accused Bogota of seeking to set off an armed conflict inside Venezuela, recruiting Venezuelan military personnel to divide the armed forces and allowing anti-Maduro rebels to operate training camps on Colombian territory. Bogota says it won't respond to the provocation, but that it's ready to defend itself if necessary. We call on all Colombians to remain calm, knowing that our forces are sufficiently equipped and capable of responding to any threat. Colombia's conservative president, Ivan Duque, for his part, has accused the Maduro government of harboring and supporting armed Colombian rebels on Venezuelan territory. In late August, the former number two leader of Colombia's FARC rebel group called for taking up arms again, despite 2016's historic peace deal ending decades of bloody conflict. Venezuelan opposition leader Juan Guaido has accused Maduro of using the tensions with Colombia as a diversion from his country's ongoing economic crisis.